I mean, I've known Chris for 11 years now, you know, so impact, we'd be here all day talking about, you know, our friendship, our talks. Um, I think the coolest thing that I've indirectly been a part of was, you know, having my daughter at the All-Star Game working for the NBA, um, doing grunt work, probably shoveling up peanut shells or something for the league. And uh, Chris recognized her and chased her down uh, into a, in a room where there was a bunch of people, I think, and just went and, you know, introduced himself again and, and just spent time talking to her. And uh, she called me or texted me later on. She's like, Dad, Chris Paul came, you know, and found me in the room. And, and I'm sure it had a huge effect on all the younger interns around her when she's sitting there doing what she's doing, licking envelopes or whatever. And here comes Chris Paul <laughs> into the room to say, hey, you know, he said her name and they talked for a while and that kind of thing. That's that's the impact he's had on me. It's, it's bigger than basketball. Uh, there's a connection and kinship there uh, from the tough talks, the coaching, uh, the texts, FaceTime watching games. That probably sticks out to me um, along with a few other things. The time that he spends with guys off the floor, uh, you know, he's he and Book have gotten so close, they, they live right by each other. And so a lot of the group get togethers are at one of their houses, you know, so that that's something that you don't see much and not, not this year with COVID, but the other areas after shoot around, how many guys you'll take and, and talk to them about the angles of a screen or a certain situation uh, with a young team like ours, he, he'll share a message with them that I just shared, but he'll help them understand it a lot better than I did. <laughs> so that, that helps me and certainly helps our players.